Hi, welcome in. Turning from God, 1 Kings 11. King Solomon was greater and richer than any other king, and people came from far and wide to hear his wisdom. Yet when he grew old, he turned away from the Lord, for he had married many foreign princesses. And as the years passed, they turned his heart to the strange gods they worshiped. God was angry and sad. For the sake of David, he did not want to take away the kingdom in Solomon's own lifetime, but he let his enemies rise up against him. One day when Jeroboam, one of the king's officials, was out walking in the country, the prophet Ahijah came to him with a message from God. Ahijah took off the new cloak he was wearing and tore it into 12 pieces. He gave 10 to Jeroboam saying, these are like the 12 tribes of Israel. I have given you 10 pieces because soon God will take away 10 tribes from Solomon and give them to you. God will punish Solomon and Israel because they have forsaken him, but he will not take away all the kingdom from David's children. He will give them the tribes of Judah and Benjamin. And if, when you are king, you serve God truly, he will give your kingdom to your sons after you. When Solomon learned what Ahijah had said, he was afraid and tried to kill Jeroboam, but Jeroboam escaped to Egypt where he stayed in safety until Solomon died. Then the kingdom of Israel split in two. In the south, the tribes of Judah and Benjamin stayed loyal to Solomon's son, King Rehoboam, but the 10 northern tribes broke away and made Jeroboam their king.